This is Eddie. Oh, that Eddie. Yep, I've heard a lot about you. <laughs> and you are? Clueless. <laughs> Sorry, um, Dawn, this is Hannah. Right, your girlfriend, sort of, maybe? Sort of, we don't do labels. Right. Um, Hannah's just visiting from Queenstown. <gasps> and you're okay with this? Why wouldn't I be? Are you sure? Yep. Wow. You guys make it look so easy. You just kind of love who you want, when you want, and no one's heart gets broken. Wish I could do that. Right, well, I've got to go. And I'm going to find some pants. Hey. Yeah? I'm not cheating on you. You never said you were. Well, you've gone all weird. Why didn't you tell me? Because I knew you'd react like this. Well, how long have you been seeing her? Well, Hannah lives in Queenstown, so technically I haven't really been seeing her that much. A few months. Who's counting? How come she knows all about me? I rave about you. Well, don't. I haven't done anything wrong, Eddie. No labels, no promises, you know that. Eddie has no right to look at me like that. But you don't need to yell at me about it. Well, I'm sorry, it's just... He's acting like I'm a cheat, and we had a deal. Like, he knew that we see whoever we want, whenever we want. But he didn't know about me. You never thought to mention me to him. Well, it's none of his business. Babe, you want to dial it down? What? You're really loud. Well, I don't care who hears me. But you just moved here. You don't need that flatmate from hell. Ugh. Hey. Yeah. I like that you chose me. I first want to see a brand new flat. It's because you're special. That's what I wanted to hear. And he knows he's special too, right? You have to talk to him. No, I don't. You said he's a nice guy. He doesn't know how to be mean. He's too nice. And you just kicked in the Bolaris. Like, ouchie. Hey, not your problem. Better check your phone, see if you're dumped yet. I wouldn't care. Yeah, you would. It's not as hard ass as you think you are. So, tell me about Mae. Well, she is alive, but lying down. And Nicole? Alive, but walking around. Anyway, back to me and how I didn't even hit the pogies. I didn't even think about them. So proud of you. <laughs> hey, look who just got home. Um, OK, Chris, no problem. You mm, posh boys. Uh, I'll see you in the morning. Totally do. I mean, goodbye and good night. Eek, what have I done? <laughs> Um, welcome home, and how's your mum? Well, you first. What's going on? I just said yes to acting director of nursing. No, you can't. Oh, well, why not? Dawn's a great nurse. Do you not think I'm up to it? Well, when I left, you were blubbering into your onesie and slobbering over Barry. No, but I fixed her. She's better now. Are you? Taking a long time to answer there, Dawn. <gasps> Sorry, I was just thinking about threesomes. Oh, that's not professional, huh? Not for a D.O.N. No, not me. Theo. What's she done? She's got a girlfriend and Eddie didn't know. Dirty hoe bag, tell me more. Sure, she's just in there. Who is? Theo, she's our new flatmate. Since when? Since tonight. All right, call a house meeting. She hasn't passed the demo check. I can't, because she's in there with her girlfriend. Right now? Mm -hmm. Oh, poor Eddie. Well, I think we need a drink. Oh, no, not tonight. I need a clear head for the morning for my new job. Oh, good morning, Flatty. Hey, Dizzy. Sorry I didn't get a chance to welcome you properly. Are you OK with me moving in? Oh, yeah. You are more than welcome. You and your friend, girlfriend, whoever she might be. Yeah, one of those. 